hours away from Vienna, Bratislava, and Prague. Artists for years have descended upon Budapest because of its beautiful architecture, its access to creative spaces, and its relatively low cost of living. It is standard European practice for artists to make their way through art school and ultimately find representation through a gallery. The artist duo of Boris Lorinch met in art school and soon joined forces becoming collaborative masters. They gained notoriety with a number of interesting pieces that challenged our way of thinking about art, especially in Hungary. The project revolves around a common identity created and shared by partners Janos Boros and Lila Lorinch. And uh, so our project is Lörinz Borsos, actually, this identity that we share. And we work together since 2008, but even before we have worked together in a bigger group, which was the, called the corporation. So we are always interested in this uh, combining and getting together and making like you know, like events and uh, so not only separate artworks but, but things that involve time also and uh, movement and stuff like this. Institutional inspirations are uh, one of our uh, favorite uh, inspirations because uh, they are so separate. All, all these classes in the school you learn that uh, there are painters, there are graphic designers, there are intermedia uh, artists and uh, there is no way to cross. So our statement is, is uh, not to choose one or, uh, or the another, but you have to keep them and uh, you have to have your, your outsider uh, approach. So after like five years dealing with uh, this, let's say, alternative uh, national image that we started to build, uh, with artworks, uh, we got a little bit fed up with it because, uh, you know, we, we just uh, f were facing that, that we are too small and too little and uh, we cannot have as much effect as we would like to. It's not that art doesn't empower us, but, but we have to look at the bigger picture, I would say. Mm -hmm. 